Hello, hello, hello! What's happening, everybody? MCOC Droid does back again with another video on Marvel Contest of Champions. So, it is, well, it's February 2nd when I'm recording this, but we'll just say it is February. It is 2019. First month is already over and done with. So, I figure now is as good a time as any to do my 2019 plans for the channel. Uh, both and for the game, so in game and real life, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, in case you have not seen, so in the last month or so, of course, there has been some big changes with the channel. Um, well, technically, it, it all started last year, literally on New Year's Eve, December 31st, so right at the very end of 2018, I hit. 1,000 subscribers, which was amazing. Uh, I'm just so happy about that. So I hit the 1K sub mark. A couple of weeks later, I became officially monetized here on YouTube. I'm part of the YouTube Partner Program now for, for getting approved after hitting 1,000 subs. Uh, so, so both of those combined within, you know, like I said, right at the end of the year and the beginning of this year, uh, it's just been amazing so far. So I, first I want to say just thank you to everybody. I know I've said it a bunch already, you know, here on YouTube, on Twitter, online, uh, you know, just in so many spots, but I, I just want to give one last like, sort of big overall thank you to everyone who has supported me so far. Whether you, you know, you subscribe to my channel, whether I chat with you online, in game, on Twitter, on Reddit, um, just the support has been so incredibly appreciated. I can't tell you how much it's appreciated. You know, I started this channel uh, right around Christmas time of 2017. So I've been doing this for about 13 months now, and it's just been amazing so far, just Seeing where I've come from those first couple of videos where my setup was even worse than it is now. Um, you know, it's very crude beginnings. But I, again, like I've just been, you know, inspired by so many other uh, YouTube creators, whether it's for this game or other games in general. Um, I've just gotten so much support. I've hopefully given support back. Um, I'd like to think that I have, you know, whether it's for individuals in the community, the community as a whole, um, just, just so much support has been given to me. Um, and I really, really do appreciate it. If I haven't, th I don't want to thank everybody here because we'd be here all day, but you know, I, I always prefer to do things more direct, you know, in terms of thank yous or appreciation or things like that. So if I haven't already, you know, I will be thanking you, but I wanted to take this opportunity first just to thank everybody for the support so far. Uh, it really means a lot to me. It, it, it really does. And I want to keep going, of course. Um, but I have to, you know, just say thank you to everything that's happened so far. So thank you. So what does that mean? What are my plans for the rest of 2019 and just in general for moving forward in the channel? What does that mean? In a word, it means more. I want to do more content overall. Um, so whether that means more of the same, of the stuff that I already do in terms of regular series, aspects of the game, Marvel Insider, etc., etc., or whether that means more new stuff, um, you know, so again, focusing on other aspects of the game, focusing on maybe more real life things that are related to the game, um, all of that is what I want to do. I just want to keep doing more stuff, like not doing content for the sake of content. I don't just want to keep throwing a bunch of stuff out there. Um, I do want to make sure that it's always good quality. It's always either important or informational or entertaining or some combination of all of that. Um, but I definitely just want to keep doing more. I want like more is going to be the key word for 2019. Um, and I'll get to more of that pun not intended in a moment but uh, i want to talk about a few aspects of the channel overall so first is the artwork um you'll if you are a subscriber to the channel if you've been around me for a while um you'll know that you know, about what was it, a couple months or so ago i started changing up how the videos look so with the screen itself, you know, shifting it over to the side so that I could do a proper overlay. So, you know, I threw in my logo up here. I threw in uh, this cool little combination of characters that I made. Um, 
and I threw in this this little MCOC Droid Des logo down here as well. Um, I I wanted to. It, it was a long time coming, but I I did it. I'm happy for it. I think it looks better than just having, you know, the letterbox look of having black bars on the left and right side of the screen. Um, that dead space, you know. I like this better. Um, and it seemed like overall everyone liked this better as well, which is cool. I just, I think it looks better again, rather than just having the dead space on either side of the screen. So I want to keep pushing with that, um, uh, potentially, you know, uh, switching up the, the middle part of the overlay. So the, uh, the characters right here, I'm, I'm thinking for my regular series, I will be changing those up in the next few weeks or so to put an image in there that is indicative of the series. So whether it's the weekly crystal opening, whether it's Marvel Insider related, um, Alliance Quest crystals, uh, feature Grandmaster crystals, deals, characters, whatever, you know, I want to do a specific overlay for each type of video that I'm doing since I predominantly do pre-recorded things rather than live streams. So, and I'll get to that in a second. So that see that um, coming soon over the next few weeks or so as I continue to work on those. Speaking about artwork, so recently um, I stumbled upon a, a Twitter user named Universal Soldier. He goes by Univ Soul on Twitter. Um, and he made me this brand new logo, which if you if you are friends with me online, if you follow me on Twitter, and as of a day or so ago, if you're a subscriber to the channel, you saw that I updated it across the board. So this was the tweet that I had sent out before. Um, again, his name is Universal Soldier or, or Univ underscore Soul on Twitter. Um, he does a bunch of these avatars, which look amazing. If you're interested at all, um, hit him up on Twitter. I believe he's also online. You know, he has his email address on Twitter as well. So check him out. If you have any requests to make some personalized stuff, um, as you can see, I just, I told him to do one for Beardo for me and he did. It was quick. Um, after I shot him the payment over with PayPal. So everything was very straightforward. Um, like I said, very fast turnaround time and amazing work. I ended up getting the 3D version. He made an animated version for me that I can only show online. That's the only one that actually allows the moving image, but it looks really cool. Um, it's, it's this cap right here that's essentially running. Um, and yeah, it looks great. He does amazing work. So by all means, check him out. If you're interested in your own avatar, hit him up. He can do a still image. He can do a 3D image um, or an animated image. Um, so yeah, definitely hit him up. So he did that for me earlier this week and I very, very quickly, um, started getting it everywhere. Like I said, it's on my, uh, line, uh, profile as well. That's the animated version. I threw it up on Twitter earlier this week. And then again, a day or so ago, I threw it up on YouTube as well and switched up some of the, uh, switched up the banner art. So I made the image, the profile image, as well as updating the banner art, as you can see right there. Um, actually, let me, I'll blow it up a little even more. So hopefully you guys and gals can see better. But um, like I said, I switched up the banner art. I threw in links, as you can see in the bottom right corner there. Um, that was another thing that was just a long time coming on the YouTube channel. Um, so I, I like that better. It's cleaner. Um, so it's got the links there. Again, I incorporated that logo that I came up with a couple of weeks ago, or a couple of months ago. Um, and then, yeah, got Universal Soldiers picture in there as well. So again, shout out to him. Awesome work. If you're interested, hit him up. Um, follow him on Twitter as well. He shows off the ones that he makes, whether it's for other people or just ones that he's making himself. Um, he's got a lot of good ones on there. So check him out and hit him up for work. Uh, if you're interested in switching up your avatar anywhere else. Uh, so as I mentioned before, you know, I, I don't live stream as much as I'd like to. Um, I, I do still want to have an overall better setup. And the, the, it starts with a new laptop. I've needed a new laptop for a long time. This thing is, is powerful. Don't get me wrong. It's a good laptop, but I've had it for two and a half, three years now. Um, 
you know, so of course it's it's slowing down, it's getting old and what have you. I, I, I tend to push it pretty hard, whether it's, you know, stuff I'm doing online, like, you know, watching Netflix, uh, downloading things, uh, of course, a bunch of YouTube, et cetera, et cetera. So it definitely is is uh, getting worn out. So I definitely need a new laptop. That is that is probably number one on the list of things that I would like to do next. Um, I would like a better desk, a physical desk. Uh, I still need an actual gaming chair, something more comfortable to sit in. I just have a regular chair that I'm sitting right now. So any, you know, super chats or, or donations through Streamlabs or PayPal or whatever, all of that stuff is going directly into the channel. Um, so, you know, I will, I will find a way to sort of make a, uh, a savings goal. You know, I'll start figuring out how much I want to save and perhaps incorporate that into my videos as well, just as a, a little part of the overlay. But uh, just know that anything that is sent to me is directly going into the channel itself. Um, because I want to be able to do more content, as I said, and I want to keep doing better content and more live streams um, so that I can, you know, give back to the community to interact with the community even more than I'm doing now. One thing that I'm doing to sort of make up for not doing as many live streams is I'm starting to premiere videos more often. Um, I, I want to keep doing it, you know, at least once a week, twice a week or so. Um, because for those who don't know, premiering videos on YouTube is a relatively newer feature that they came out with last year. Where as, the best way to describe it is it's literally a live stream for pre-recorded videos. What I mean by that is... Um, you know, instead of just normally scheduling a video, I'll say, you know, have it go live Tuesday at five o'clock or whatever. When I do that, um, or when anybody on YouTube does that, they can turn it into a premiere. So what essentially happens is you still schedule the video for the day, the day and time you want it to go live. But then when it does, uh, people can hang out, people can chat, people can do the super chats, um, you know, the mods are in there as well in the chat. So essentially, it's all of the aspects of a live stream, but for a pre-recorded vid. So anybody hanging out, you know, they get a notification shortly before it goes live. When it does go live, it play the video plays once. So everybody hanging out will essentially watch it in real time. You know, you can't skip it. As far as I know, you can't like skip ahead or anything. Um, so it's essentially a live premiere of a pre-recorded video. So I will absolutely be doing that at least once a week with my weekly crystal openings, which will be on Sunday, uh, still Sunday, which they've always been, but they will premiere every Sunday at 1 p.m. Pacific time. This one was a little late because I was having problems with YouTube uh, this past Sunday. But unless you hear from me otherwise, it will be every Sunday, 1 p.m. Pacific time. And I will be there to hang out in the chat with you all, watch with you, to see what I open, to talk about stuff, um, anything. Like I said, it's literally exactly the same as a live stream, just with a pre-recorded video. Um, I will also be doing that at least, you know, hopefully once a week, twice a week on top of that, based on how much content I'm putting out for that week. Um, but I do want to make sure I'm doing it at least once a week in addition to whatever live streams I can sneak in. Um, so that again, I at least have the opportunity to hang out with you all, to chat with you all. Again, people can, can type in chat as normal. They can do super chats as normal. Um, it's literally the same as a live stream. So definitely excited to keep that rolling. Um, I have, again, I, I want to keep rolling with the series that I already do, whether it's, you know, uh, the weekly crystal opening Alliance quest crystals, Marvel insider related stuff and what have you. But there are other series that I either want to continue on or start. Uh, the biggest one that I need to continue on, of course, is the specials. I started it towards the end of last year. Um, I do want to do a catalog of every how to evade every single special in the game. Uh, special one and two, of course, since you can't evade special threes. But, you know, I, I started in November and then it just fell by the wayside. You know, I did one initial round of, of, uh, of characters. And then, like I said, I've just gotten sidetracked with other things. Um, and I just haven't had the time to go back to it. So rest assured for those who actually know that this exists, um, that I will be going back to it very soon and I will continue on. And the goal is still to have videos up for every single character in the game and how to evade their special ones and special twos. 
there's another series that I want to get rolling pretty soon. I'm not going to go too much into it because um, I want to keep it a surprise for now. I will say that, again, I'm recording this on February 2nd. Literally last night, we unintentionally got an announcement and then got the official announcement that uh, there is a beta coming up in the next week or so with She-Hulk and Spider-Gwen getting potential reworks. Um, again, I don't want to go into the series and how this affects it, but needless to say, it does affect it a little bit. Um, more details on that to follow probably later in February. Uh, but rest assured that it is, um, it's a good way to put it. It will definitely be a interact, uh, a slightly interactive viewer inspired, uh, series. That's all I want to say on it right now. More details to follow. Uh, later this month of February. On top of that, um, you know, I want to look into memberships here as well for you two, for anyone who may be interested. Um, I may look into Patreon as well to potentially do some uh, some memberships there as well. So, so from the ba -ba -ba -ba, that's good talking right there, isn't it? Um, I'm not going to cut that out because it's funny or I think it's funny. Um, but no, I do want to look into YouTube memberships, into Patreon memberships uh, for anyone who may be interested for other ways of supporting the channel um, to have some exclusive benefits or maybe some behind the scenes type content for me, for how I record, for other content that is in the early st stages of development. I'll just say that. Um, so yeah, I will be looking into that. I'll let you all know when I figure out what I want to do when I get those up and running. Um, again, just for more opportunities to support the channel, which I can then turn around and give back to you all. Um, what else did I want to talk about? Potential, you know, it's been a while since I've done a giveaway. I, I wouldn't mind doing one of those pretty soon. It's been a little while. Um, can maybe like a belated 1K subs giveaway. Um, just because, again, it's been a little while since I've done that. And I, I do love giving back to you all. Um rather than just investing in the game. So I will be on the lookout for one of those soon. I, like I said, it's been a long time coming, so I wouldn't mind doing one of those again. Uh, checking my notes here next to me, I think that pretty much covers everything. Um, so yeah, I have, as you can see, I have a fair amount of ideas for 2019 in addition to everything that I am already doing, just hopefully more and hopefully better. Those, if I had to have a second word for 2019, it would be better. More and better is going to be the phrase of the year. Um, but that will wrap it up. So hopefully you are interested in some of this stuff and all of this stuff would be great. Um, but let me know in the thoughts in the comments down below what your thoughts are with all of the stuff that I've been referring to, with the stuff that I have planned. Um, you know, again, I, I'm always interested in talking to the community, interacting with the community. You know, one thing that I will always strive to do as much as I possibly can is making sure that I'm reading every single comment on my videos, responding to every single comment on my videos. I always want to make sure that I'm doing that as much as possible because I want you all to know um, that I appreciate your comments, whether they're good, whether they're bad, whether they're helpful, whether they're critical. Um, you know, I don't want anyone to feel like they're not being heard or I'm not interacting with them. Um, so that is something that I absolutely want to keep doing as much as I am now and even more, hopefully. You know, I want to make sure that everyone feels like they're actively participating in the channel if they so choose. So, yeah, let me know in the comments down below what your thoughts on all this stuff. Um, if you're not already a subscriber, feel free to hit that subscribe button, ring the bell so you get notified when all this stuff is happening, live streams, new content, premieres. Um, yeah, I'm excited. I'm very excited for 2019 and what this year could bring, will bring, already has brought to the channel. Um, I'm very much looking forward to it and I got to do one more thank you to everybody because your support truly, truly means so much to me. Um, and I want to keep it going as much as I can for as long as I can. So be on the lookout. 2019 is going to be a great year. I would hope so for hopefully for Marvel Contest of Champions and hopefully for MCOC Droid does. Uh, that is all for now. So thank you for watching. Take care and I will see you next time.